and gentlemen, you have just witnessed the devastating firepower of Taurus, an anti-tank weapon of unique design. The work is being carried out at our research establishment under conditions of high security. This prototype is the result of two years' research and development, and we are still working on a laser-controlled guidance system, the only one of its kind in the world. The final version of the weapon will begin production in a few weeks' time, when the guidance system has been perfected. However, members of my staff will be happy to answer any questions you may have, so if you would care to adjourn to the next room, they will circulate amongst you whilst you enjoy the hospitality of the Ministry of Defence. <laughs> Listen, old boy, you want to be careful of who you talk to. I take it you're with the Pentagon. Uh, no, international press. I'm a freelance journalist. Excuse me. This, uh, this looks delicious. Thank you. No, I mean, it's absolutely beautiful. It's a well-known fact. The most important aspect of any demonstration of military inventiveness is the uh, catering arrangements. Really? Yeah, well, Napoleon said it. An army marches on its stomach. Uh, Eine Armee marschiert auf... Den Magen. Ah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. May I see your ID, Mrs. Miller? Bill, what are you doing here? Just keeping an eye on things as usual. How lovely to see you. It's been ages. Two years. How are the children? Philip must be what? Thirteen? Philip's fourteen and Dinah will be thirteen in May. I shouldn't have left it so long. I tell you what, what about next Thursday? We can't. You pick the one time we'll be away. Somewhere nice? I hope so. I've borrowed a cottage from a friend. In fact, you know them, the Giles? Of course. Alec and Barbara. That's right. He's retired from the service now. Well, you couldn't have chosen a nicer place. It's miles from anywhere. The children will love it. That's what I'm trying to do. <sighs> Won't be needing them for a while. should I know? He belongs to you. I sit here, and my friend Emma Jane sits there. This is my project. Ah! You must be Diana Mannering. Yes, Miss Anderson. Your mother wrote to me about Lucy Ann joining you for the holiday. And you do have your train ticket. Yes, my mother sent them to me. This is yours. Thank you. And I've arranged for Miss Farrell to accompany you both as far as your station. She only lives two stops further down. And your mother will be at the station to meet you. Right. Is that quite clear? Come along. Now's the time to start the great adventure. Oh, you ready, Phil? Where have you been? Gonna miss the train. Got bad time. You have? Are you sure? Let me check. Here it is. Your train leaves at eleven forty-five, so for heaven's sake, don't miss your connection. Tickets enclosed. You're right. Bags of time. <coughs> Tickets. You haven't lost them. When did you last have them? Uh, yesterday, I think. Oh, no. <coughs> Shut up, Kiki. Kiki. No, I know I put them somewhere safe. Well, get packing. Listen, she definitely said she'd be here to meet the train. You don't suppose Jack and Philip have got here before us, do you? No. Mum wouldn't have gone off without us anyway. Spring cottage. It sounds fabulous. Mm. Not too sure about the woods. It's probably crawling with all sorts of Philip's little furry friends. He's so good with animals, though, isn't he? Good? Too good. Frogs in your pockets. Mice in your slippers. Caterpillars down your neck. Mum's here. Mummy. Oh, darling, I'm sorry. Traffic. Aunt Alice. Oh, hello. How are you? Fine. Hello. Is 
isn't it? But better. Oh, I've missed you. I've missed you so much. I've missed you too. Oh, you got biffed in the nose. <laughs> Sweet, you're right. It's not your lucky day. Why didn't Philip and Jack get here? Ah, very good point. Very soon, next train. Come on. Hello, darling. Oh, oh, I found you. you. Oh, have you been? All right, thanks. Yeah? How's everything at the house? Oh, yes. not too bad. A terrible mess, in truth. Oh, sorry. Yes. We've got some to get right. Well, that's the price you have to pay. Oh, please. Oh. What's that? Cacato Goffini. What? <laughs> a cockatoo. Have you got a ticket for it? No. But it's in a cage. I can see it's in a cage, otherwise it would have flown here on its own, wouldn't it? Yeah, I will. Thank you. Is it far, Mum? About half an hour. How's Gran? Oh, you know your grandmother. She never likes to admit to being ill. Aren't there many rare birds around here, Aunt Ali? Yes. Yes, lots, Gran. In fact, we've even got our own geese at the cottage. Really? What kind? Great one. <laughs> What's this place? I'm not sure of it. Um, I think it's something to do with the Ministry of Defence. It's probably a school for spies. <laughs> Please. <laughs> They've had a sighting. They're sure it's him. Sure as they can be. Heathrow Immigration spotted him and tipped off surveillance. They're keeping an eye on him, yes? And no. Uh, they lost him. Still where? The washroom. How can you lose someone in a washroom? It was the uh, ladies. Are you telling me that a male suspect goes into a ladies' washroom and they don't follow him just... Just because it's got ladies written on the door. Tell them I want their report on my desk this afternoon. Do you understand? Uh, Colonel, it appears uh, an unwelcome visitor has just arrived on our shores. Who's he working for? Freelance. Works for the highest bidder. And you think he may be after the tourist guidance system? Well, I don't think he's come here for a vacation. It is up to you and your men, Cunningham, to ensure maximum protection. We can't afford any slip-ups. You understand? Now, if you'll excuse me. I'm just as good friends with Dinah as you are with Phil. I'll be Dinah. Yeah. Better, maybe. Here we are. Oh, yeah. brilliant. Spring Cottage. <laughs> you didn't think I was going to run into it, did you? No, I knew oh, you come wouldn't. On. You trust me more than that, don't you? Him down a from rat! Oh! Come on, let me introduce no! you. He'll like him die. He's grey. Go away, Philip. What's the matter? What is going on? That idiot's got a rat. There's no need to get excited, Di. It's not a rat. Look. Oh, Philip, why must you do this? Come on, darling, get out of the car. Uh! Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Uh! No, Dinah, stop it. You're not going to argue like this for the rest of the holiday. You'll spoil it for everyone. Do you understand? He started it. I haven't got pockets full of vermin. Hedgehogs aren't vermin. I don't care what they are, Philip. Please, pick up the cases and come inside. Come on. Oh, 
This is a really good place. Yeah. Kiki will enjoy not living in a cage. Ah, there you are. Up we go. Oh, wow. Can I pick something? Oh, Home Philip's sleeping in the attic. Oh, Dinah, Can I have the biggest room? You're all right, you come on. We're having it. Come on. Say hello to your new home. You go up there. Off you go. On the way. To the left. It's a lovely cottage. Okay. Boys to the right. Girls to the left. Yeah, off there. <laughs> What a lovely room. Yeah. Look at the two. Look. Castle. I wonder if anybody lives there. Doubt it. And if Philip starts collecting little fairy monsters again, I'll murder him. Dinah. Yes, Mum? You promise. No more arguments, remember? We don't argue. We have differences of opinion. You have more differences of opinion than Tom and Jerry. We have more to fight over. Dinah. I wish you and Philip wouldn't fight so much, Dinah. Mum, I can't find any clean towels. <laughs> Yeah, really. All right. Anything to it? Hello. 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 <laughs> um, can I help you? Oh, I, I'm sorry to interrupt you. Uh, I'm uh, Sam, uh, Sam, uh, the local rag and bone man. No, that there are as many rags of bones around these days. It's more like old fridges, television sets, or bald motor tires. <laughs> Though I do lay my hands on a regular supply. <laughs> Real dainty, eh? Farm fresh, too cheaper than the shops. How much are they? Oh, I leave that to you, Miss. I'll go and ask Mum. Ask her if she'd like a nice rabbit for the pot. Or a shoulder of lamb, guaranteed fresh. Or a real plump peasant. They're not in season. Oh, not for some, I grant you. Do you like a cup of tea? Ah, the cup of tea. Yes, yes. <laughs> That's very kind. Thank you very much. Mum says thank you very much. Oh, that's very generous. Thank you kindly. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, thank you kindly. Ah. Mm. Mm. Oh! Cheese and biscuits. <laughs> yeah, cheese and biscuits. You're right. Oh, that's nice. A little bit of cheddar in there. If ever you need any cheese, you let Sam know. I'm here at your service. That is very nice, too. Mmm. Oh, very nice. Could a king ask for more? If I was a king, I'd have hamburger and chips every day. Hamburger and chip day? Well, I'd have to see what I can do. Difficult one. Morning, all. Can I take it up? Nice to see you, and thank you for the eggs. Oh, that's very nice. Thank you. Your towels are upstairs, when you want them. Oh, great. Thanks, Mum. Uh, Sam? Hmm? Does anyone live in that castle? Castle? Oh, oh no, no, that castle. No, no, no. Nobody lived there for years. Why not? Derrick. You know what derrick means? It's from the Latin relic, isn't it? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Well, of course. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, down the wrong way. Now, what like, that in town. Oh, great. I'll put it in his cage later. I like that. Abandoned for years. No, he's, he's got a terrible history. <laughs> Hangings and beheadings. Treachery and betrayal, deceit and devilry, and it freeze the blood in your veins. You've heard of Dracula and the werewolf. Ow! Have you? Yes. Well, they're nothing to what goes on up there. No, 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 nobody could get into that castle, not since the track was blocked by a landslide years ago. Well, and good thing too, I reckon. Well, thank you kindly for the snack. I best be about my business.
Oh, well. <clears throat> Grace not, want not. I'm sure you don't need to have any on this take as well. And I take a little bit of this for my horse, Bob. Clear <laughs> the way for old Sam Tucker. He's too late to get his supper. Snap. Thank you again. Look at those. Mum was wrong. They're not gravies. Beautiful, aren't they? They're Chinese. Quite rare in this country. Must be full of wildlife. And wildfowl. I wonder if that boat's in here. I know how to find out. How? We'll get Dinah to try it out. And if it sinks, she'll get wet. <laughs> Mind you, boats are no good if there are no oars. There's a mallard out there. Let's try the boat. Phil? Phil? Where are you? Phil? Phil, you in here? Yeah. Stay there, Kiki. <laughs> Where did you find that? It's over in the corner. I bet nobody's been in here for years. It must be full of some really useful stuff. Useful? It looks more like old junk. It may look like old junk. Some of this stuff could come in handy. Handy, handy. <laughs> Remember the school play? Oh, yeah. Hangarda. <laughs> Submit, Sir Percy. I submit. I give you your life. Thank you, Phil. See? You never know when old junk might come in handy. We might need some of this stuff if we get any problems up at the castle. Problems? Dracula. Remember? <laughs> Hangings, beheadings, treachery, betrayal, devilry. Freeze the blood. Oh! <laughs> what do you think Bill would say to all that? He'd say it's a load of rubbish. A load of rubbish. You're right. He would. <laughs> What's this? Look. Squirrels. They've eaten it away. I wonder if we're near that castle. I'll take a look from up there. Can you see it? No, but... You must be looking the wrong way, idiot. Come on, Jack. Hang on. That's all. Oh, come on. Phil. What? There's somebody over there with binoculars. Spying on us? I don't know. I... Well, he's going anyway. What did he look like? Difficult to say. He was in the trees. He's probably just a bird watcher like you. Go on, Kiki. your tracks. Let's go on. Aquila Crisitos, the golden eagle. He's got to have a wingspan of seven foot. Look at him, Phil. 
Isn't he incredible? Come on, let's see if we can get closer. I never thought I'd see one in the wild. Look, the castle. We were right on top of it all the time. Well, let's see if there's a way through. 